What's going on, you guys? Welcome back to another My name is Jeff. reaction. Welcome back to Within Temptation Wednesday. I'm going to get back on track and do Within Temptation Wednesdays again. If another reaction or request or something comes up, we'll do that later in the week or something. I'm going to remold this to get the schedule back on track, but I hope you guys are having a good day. And if not, I hope I can bring some sort of positive light to it. Because, guys, whatever's going on for you, whatever it may be, just remember that you are not alone. You are never alone. You're a warrior. You're a soldier. Stay strong. I believe in you. And if you need it, the comments are there for you to vent, or you can DM me personally on my socials. But you do got this. Bro fist. High five. You got this, guys. I know it's easier to send the number, but you got this. Try and stay with me. Now, without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and dive in. We're doing more of the, crap, what is it, our tone sessions? Yes. I think we only got one more song because I'm, as I'm looking at their page here, I only see Ritual, which I've done, Faster, which I've done, Bleed Out, which I've done, uh, Fool's Parade, The Sneak Peek, and there's We Go to War. I think there was five songs in here. Yeah, I've already done all of them, so we've only got one more song in the uh, acoustic sessions to do. One of you told me that they're going to have another live performance going up soon. Um, I see Faster is going to go up live this Friday, so I will most likely uh, do that next week if you guys want to look for that. Actually, not most likely. I will do that this Friday, so if you guys want to look for that next week. But regardless, we're going to do We Go to War. And if there's anything else you guys want to see, please, for the love of God, let me know because I've run out of uh, other things to check out by them. So between this and the next live performance of Faster, please let me know what else you want to see. But for now, we're going to finish off the... The acoustic performances here we go to war i don't want to waste any time let's do this i'm excited guys oh man they actually still did that in the acoustic version i can't believe it that's gotta be the piano that's a piano doing that that's not something they did in editing somebody's playing the piano to get that sound oh i love it i can't believe they did that intense and it's another part of the piano or a different pianist who knows real quick I just love the sheer authenticity like that's got to be a piano like I don't know if you guys can hear me during that but seriously that's got to be the piano like because there's no way you could get that sound live unless you had a piano because most of the time you think a sound like that synthesizer whatever it is that art electronic sound that would usually only be produced through like a computer in the post-production of the song the more the more time goes on and technology advances i think you can actually do that on the piano so i want to say that they're they're either there's either two pianists or the the one guy that's on the piano is literally just doing two different sounds and two different sides of the keyboard from what i've seen overthinking the heck and back already but i'm pretty sure that's what that is i'm talking like i would at the end of a song i just you gotta say something Sharon's voice, of course. Stunning. Yeah. 
such a good voice. Just how? It's amazing. Mm. Hold on one second. I just want to say one thing just really quick. Her voice is absolutely haunting live, especially when she does that. Like she's legitimately haunting. I love it. I'll say it again time and time again. Freaking siren i don't know how she's doing that but i love it it's so beautiful it's like i know how they're doing this but i don't at the same time like i recognize that they have the other instruments but it baffles me just the fact that they can do this and make it acoustic and it's not like the full it sounds like the soundtrack but it's unplugged at the same time like it's crazy <laughs> Fade out, fade out. Bro, there's... There's so many things I could say. There's just so many. I can't, I, I literally can't anymore. I almost hate myself that I can't think of anything else to say, but what else can I say? Help me, internet. How else do you so describe this band how else do you describe sharon's amazing voice and just how incredible the rest of the band is for pulling like there's a lot of this stuff like i know they're genuinely talented i firmly believe that i would never knock them whatsoever but those usual final touches not necessarily auto-tune but just those extra little tweaks that they do in the studio like they didn't even need that like this is live and it sounds like it did on the soundtrack but like and I, I'm almost sounding total hip hypocritical with this. I'm almost sounding like I'm just basically canceling everything out. Like, yeah, maybe they actually don't do those little tweaks in the soundtrack. Maybe they may, they are just that. Like, I do believe they're extremely talented. Do, you guys know what I'm trying to say, though? Like, I'm not knocking them at all. And I don't even feel as guilty as I normally do. I mean, there's going to be those people that haters are going to hate. Somebody's going to go, dude, you're talking way too much. Like, I don't get what you're saying at all. You're sounding like... You, you act like Sharon and them don't have any talent. And that's not what any of you are saying. I know. I, I know a lot of you are very good about just being comfortable. Like, we're good. You and I, we're all good. I know. I love Sharon and them. And I, I, I recognize their sheer talent. I'm just, like, noting how most of the time in the studio they change the sound just a little bit. Not drastically. I'm, again, I'm... I'm, I'm addressing auto-tune as like one of the tweaks, like they might just slightly tweak Sharon's voice. Maybe they tweak the instruments, maybe they tweak her voice just a little bit, maybe there's auto-tune, maybe there's not. But no, like there's, I would never in any shape or form say that Sharon is auto-tuned. They might touch some things, I don't know exactly what they touch, but they usually, like, I don't know if it's protocol or probably not even a law. They just, you know, just to make it cleaner and make the sound a little bit more crisp or whatever like there's usually something they do to tweak it for the soundtracks obviously it doesn't sound live it sounds like a cd there's that stereo sound they do something in the studio for that but you can like this doesn't just sound live like this it's it obviously sounds live but it like it's acoustic but like it's genuine acoustic but with every single instrument that you usually hear in the soundtrack minus the orchestra behind them I don't know how they managed to do that. I mean, I guess it's possible to just get that electric guitar and just, you know, you you it's not added into the studio and it sounds like a soundtrack guitar. It's literally everything without that touch of the studio, but like it's genuinely acoustic. Most of the time you'd say, well, that's not acoustic. It's just live. I mean, maybe to some extent, maybe it is just live and they're calling it acoustic because they're in that little room. I don't know exactly what classifies that particularly as acoustic for that 
session, but I'm overthinking. I know it, and you guys can call me out for it. You know what I'm trying to say. I know you guys know what I'm trying to say. I'm confusing myself. I know what I want to say, but the way that I'm wording it is just zero. I still love it. They are breathtaking. Like I love how they're doing this, and I want to hear more like this. I want to hear more other songs by them, but I also want to hear more performances. I love these guys. Any video that they do, any song, any performance, even if it's a song I've heard a hundred times, anything that they drop, I'm here for it. I want it. They're amazing. I am in love. The whole band, straight up. I need to shut up now. I'm ranting about I don't even know what. Simple as that. I'm lo I am I love the song. I love the performance. I'm trying to elaborate, and I'm, just, I'm literally losing myself in the process, trying so hard to elaborate where I don't think. You guys in the comments to let me know what you think. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thank you so very much for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And as always, remember, my name is Jeff. Pep Junkies Unite. And I'll see you guys tomorrow as always. Love, peace, and chicken grease. You guys have a fantastic day and a fantastic night.